Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today I'm going to be making another Sims 4 character because I just felt like it and this one was really fun. So if you guys couldn't tell already, I am really bad when it comes to making eyes. So I just went on the internet, found one I really liked and just used that and then just expanded it a little bit because I love doe eyes, they're adorable. So obviously I had to go for a more of a doe eye look. And once again, I have come across my worst nightmare, which is skin details. Guys, I can't even stress this enough. I hate doing skin details. I am way too indecisive about them, and it always takes me hours to get it done. Now on to makeup. Guys, makeup is probably one of my favorite things to do when creating a sim. It just adds so much to the sim. I honestly might have to say that it adds more to the sim than sometimes skin details do because if you have the right makeup, the sim looks beautiful. Now here I was struggling because I don't know what happened. I don't know what mod was doing this to my sim. I'm gonna have to go find out and get rid of it because it was a pain. Not only were the whole lids of her eyes looking really weird after, even without the skin detail on, just in general, it looked so weird to me. I just could not get past it. I was struggling so bad.
Now, can we just talk about how some of the hairs look so bad with blonde hair? Like, I don't understand why. Darker hair is way easier to style on a sim than blonde is because the texture of some hairs just looks so odd on blonde hair. Another thing I just cannot deal with is when accessories break the eyelashes on my sim. It is such a pain. And then I find a cute accessory like that right there, the little bows, but my eyelashes are glitching out. So now I gotta go on a hunt for new eyelashes that don't break. I swear, sometimes I feel like I'm playing an Easter hunt with my family, but it's in the sims and it don't actually get a prize. Now, for The Sims clothing, I did something very much out of my comfort zone because I love skirts, but I personally don't think I can style skirts well. So I went on a dig here and just decided to try doing a skirt and I think it turned out pretty cute, but I'm gonna let you guys decide because as I said, it's very much out of my comfort zone and I'm not used to using skirts. Once again, I am just randomizing names because I cannot come up with names for the life of me. And 
And here I'm just doing a little 360 of her with my shaders on just to make sure that I do like the last little outcome that I have. Here she is, completely done. I think she turned out adorable, but you guys should let me know too, just in case. Thank you for sticking around for the whole video if you made it this far, and make sure to check out my other Creating a Sim video. Bye!